Hey everybody, it's Mike here coming to you from good old Cordy Mazda. Great place to be. This is a little video for all you great people out there, all you wonderful people checking us out from the comfort of your own home. This is the 2024 Mazda CX-5 Suna. Check it out, 2024 Mazda CX-5 Suna. I love the Zircon sand paint on here. It's kind of like a khaki or a desert storm style paint. Hides the dirt really, really well. You got that... Uh, Nice painted finish around the outside of the wheel wells. It goes along the bottom sill as well. You got that matching black paint on the rims. It has a uh, all season Toyo tire with a mud and snow rating on them, 19 inches. You got 19 inch rims and tires, uh, fully independent suspension system. Check out the styling on that CX-5. I love that Suna B. This thing is, is really, really cool. It's got a little bit of a, 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 a uh, trim on the inside that's a little different than the other CX-5s. It's got that really cool looking paint. Signal lamps built into the outside rear view mirror to let other drivers know what your intentions are. You got a blind spot monitoring system that shows up here to, to let you know if someone's coming up beside you on in your blind spot. Check out the styling in the front end of this thing. This is a turbocharged 2.5 liter four cylinder engine producing up to 320 foot pounds of torque and 250 horsepower with premium fuel. If you decide that you want to go with a regular fuel, it's about 220 horsepower and 310 foot pounds of torque. Lots and lots of power, very fuel efficient as well, and nice looking, nice looking way to get around. Behind the Mazda symbol here is this is a plexiglass. Behind the Mazda symbol here is your adaptive cruise control. You got headlights that'll turn you as you go around corners. Automatic high beam, low beam, automatic daytime, nighttime and they work off of cameras and sensors you got autonomous braking and lane departure warning system and i love that zircon paint it's really really nice um, painted black mirrors as well i think i already mentioned that you also got the button on the door to lock or unlock the car and check out that beautiful interior with that terracotta leather upholstery nice little black piping on there uh beautiful bolsters to hold you into your seat while you're ripping around corners you got a suede insert that's perforated you got some all-weather floor mats down here. You got a little bit of terracotta stitching that matches the seats on the door. You got that Bose sound system. You got a little bit of brushed aluminum on the door handles and stuff like that. And nice looking dash. Give you a little bit of a dash sweep here with the brushed aluminum and your dual zone climate control. Has heated seats, ventilated seats, heated steering wheel, six-speed automatic transmission that you can change gears electronically. It's got the sunroof up top. You've got side curtain airbags. It's got a heads-up display, leather wrap steering wheel. It's got pretty much everything you could possibly imagine. Even has heated seats in the back here. Your rear passengers are gonna love that. So getting in and out of the back of this thing, very comfortable. Nice height to get in and out of. Um, got lots of headroom, a couple hundred pounds, six feet tall myself. And having owned a CX-5 myself, I can tell you, it easily fits four guys and four sets of clubs. Go on a golf trip, hit the road, fit your dog. It pretty much does it all. So uh, they're a nice size vehicle and very fuel efficient and sporty to drive. Check it out back here. Lots and lots of space. I got an armrest with some cup holders and my heated seats. And I got two USB ports underneath here and cup holders. I think I mentioned that more than once. Headrests. Side curtain airbags that drop out of the ceiling, protect your rear passengers. Um, Isofix anchors back here and top tether anchors if you got uh, child seats back here. There's the spot to be right there, folks, behind the steering wheel. Um, really comfortable to, to drive. Great in the city, great in the snow, great in the country. It really pretty much hits all the, hits all the highlights that you'll need. Let's go check out the hatch. So back here, the hatch... Uh, LED tail lights. You got a dual zone or a, a dual exhaust system. You got that wiper up top. It's got that backup camera. And open says me. Power lift gate on the back here. And that's a reversible trunk trunk board here, so you can have it on that side or that side. Check out the Bose sound system that they put in here, and that's an actual speaker that they put into the into the spare tire, which is really cool. It gives you a nice little sound. It's got, uh, like I said, it's got the 40-20-40 split folding seat, and you do have some quick releases here. If I pull that lever right there, then watch what will happen. Poof! It goes down quick in a hurry. Fit all your stuff back here. Listen to your Bose sound system. It's beautiful. So you just push the button again, close up the door. There's the back end of the uh, vehicle. Close says me. So I'm going to get in behind the driver's seat here and tell you a little bit more about what that's like. 
nice height to get in and out of uh, push button start by the way it also has a memory uh, memory seat um, it's got memory seats that will attach you can have up to four different positions memorized one for each key so that's two positions memorized for for one for each key and then you got two more inside here so you could have up to four different positions memorized if you want to um it's really cool and then over here you got your uh on and off open and close your rear door there's your there's your lane departure warning system if you want to turn that notification off in the outside rear view mirror here it has a light that'll come on for your blind spot that's what the light looks like there and uh those mirrors are also heated when you push rear defrost, it'll turn on the outside rear view mirror. By the way, when you push front defrost, it'll de-ice your windshield wipers and do the front, the front window as well. So really cool. There's something called a heads up display. I don't know if you can see it in the windshield there. Uh, I'll turn my cruise control on so you can, yeah, you sort of see those bars going up and down. That's the same thing as what you're seeing here in the dash. So it gives you your heads up display, gives you your speed, con speed control, your speed, your navigation, all up in the windshield there. So it keeps your eyes on the road. Uh, you can look at all that same stuff down here. Also tells you posted speed limits. And uh, if you've got your phone hooked up, Android Auto, Apple CarPlay, Google Maps, and that screen gets real colorful. It's got a wireless Android Auto, Apple CarPlay system if you want to enjoy that. Uh, on this, back to the steering wheel here again. No one bouncing around a little bit. You got uh, gear selector. You got minus on this side. You got plus on this side if you want to shift gears. There's your automatic headlights, your stereo controls, next song, previous song, voice command for Hey Google or, or, or Hey Siri. And then you got your uh, cruise control. And, and with the cruise control system, you can actually adjust how close you want to be to the driver in front of you by using this adjustment on the steering wheel. It measures it by time. Over here, you got your heated seats and ventilated seats and heated steering wheel, dual zone climate control, um, and your all your stereo stuff, all your stuff up on the screen here is all controlled from this HMI commander down here. It's kind of like a mouse for the screen. You got your volume and your, your uh, HMI commander, electronic parking brake. Multiple drive modes, basically you can put it into sport mode if you're going to drive in the city or on the country road. Normal will be most fuel efficient. Off-road is anytime you leave the pavement, a lock in your rear differential will give you full-time four-wheel drive. <clears throat> Last but not least here, folks, let's test out the stereo. It's got that nice Bose sound system. Really nice crystal clear sound so that's it that's the 2024 mazda cx-5 suna available here right now if you or somebody you know is in the market for a cx-5 or something like that like a crv or a rav4 come check out the cx-5s come have a look take them out for a spin i'm sure you'll be impressed uh i'd love to hear from you if you get a chance you want to give me a call at 250-338-5777 you can email me mike at courtneymazda.com thanks for watching everybody and have a great day